a very good morning to everyone i am balaji and today i am going to explain the entropy concept that is nothing but to explain the concept of entropy i am present giving the example before introducing entropy i would like to define the definition what is entropy it is nothing but the randomness or the disorderness of the system before introducing i would like to show the formula of the entropy that is the del s equals to q reversible by t q is the heat divided by the t is the temperature it is the reversible so question is the for boiling of x entropy is increases or decreases and why why what is the reason behind after boiling of x entropy is increase or decrease if decrease why if increase why we have to think the yolk concept of the egg yolk is the yellowish part inside the egg there is a yellowish part inside the egg which is called which contains the protein most protein contains the linear polymer built from the series of up to 20 different l alpha amino acids suppose this one is the egg inside the egg there is a yellowish part and some white part is also there the white clear liquid called as albumin here is some nutritional value of the egg how much the water contained protein fat and the mineral for the egg white and the egg yolk after boiling of egg the protein linear polymer chain breaks off into the small pieces and fragments causing entropy to increase suppose this one is the polymer chain after heating or the boiling of the egg it is break into small fragments small fragments which results to increase in the boiling increase in the entropy before boiling of egg the protein or the linear polymer chain never breaks so entropy is less as compared to the boiling egg see most of the student thinks that entropy will in increase after boiling of the egg because or entropy will decrease most of the student thinks that entropy will decrease after boiling because the liquid yolk get solidified and there is no random movement but that is wrong after boiling of the egg entropy will increase due to the breaking of the polymer chain which contains the protein thank you for watching this video thanks a lot